been informed by the king that we'll be expecting a very important personality here in this palace anytime soon. So, we are expected to be in our best behavior, carry out all duty assigned to us with utmost carefulness. Alright now, you are assigned to work with the sheriff. While you matter, you work closely with me on that day. Am I understood? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, yes. Thank you. Who could this very important personality be? Mata. Eh? We do not have business with who enters this palace, okay? Huh. Our duty here is to serve the real home with utmost loyalty. Yes, ma'am. So anything aside of this is not our business mm. and never our job description. Uh, I've heard. Oh, Mrs. Perfect, you always have something to say to counter gossips. Why? I beg. Can tell me see this in national games. I think I am now. This ticket don't cost. This ticket don't cost. Hey. Okay, now I can use this to Make him no cost no ticket. ticket no Chita, please, I'm sorry. I, I understand that I wronged you yesterday. I am sorry. Yeah? I don't like seeing you like this. Anytime you're in this mood, it makes me sad. I, I promise you, I will not do it again. It will never happen again. Please forgive me. Cheta Bikuziano. Eh, please, if not for anything, for the for the sake of our unborn child, please. I beg you, please. Please, if you know what is good for you, leave my presence. Please leave my presence before I do something you and I will regret. It has not got into this now. Eh, Orubeno, Otua. Eh, please, I'm sorry. Okay, fine, no problem. If if it's if it's to do. Oh, if it's to do, no problem. Let, let us go and do. As a matter of fact, you can do as much as you want. If that will bring peace, what, what, no problem. What, what is wrong with you? No, no, it's obvious that stupidity runs in your lineage. What is wrong with you? Look, go back to your father's house. Leave my present, Dabrechi. Leave my present. Chita. Chita, this is not the man I used to know. This is not the man I fell in love with. I, I know I hurt you by getting pregnant. I am sorry. I am sorry. It is it is what you put in there that germinated. It is not me now. You know, I, 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 I would never want to do this to you. But it is here already. Let us accept the gift of God. And I, know, I also know that financially you are bothered. Because financially you are not doing well. Pocheta, I have been fasting. I have been praying. I've been, I've been working hard. Praying for you so that you will succeed. Because when you succeed, I succeed. When you're happy, I am happy. And now, um, please, so just believe me. This phase will pass away. It will come to pass. You will testify. Dabrechi, this phase will only pass. This phase will only pass if you get out of my life and leave my house for good. I mean, what is so difficult for you to understand? Please. 
get out of my presence. Sit down where you talk like I said, get out of my presence. You hug. Don't, don't, don't make Get out of my presence, my friend. What's wrong with you? You're holding me with your weight. Get out of my presence. Get out of my presence. Get out of my presence. What's wrong with you? Get out of my presence. Get out. <laughs> Since you don't want to leave this house, be prepared for me. You have to be prepared for me. Oh no. Tell us, who is this very important personality that is coming to visit us that we have to put on our royal regalia in a few days to come? Who is the person? Uh, it's uh, Princess Zikora, the daughter of the revered King Ahamba. The King of Kings. You all know him. Wow, I know this is interesting. Interesting indeed. Excuse me, um, is she going to come as a royal delegate or what? No, the King said she's already chosen as a bride for Prince Lutana. Wow. <laughs> it's a recent decision taken by the King and that's the reason uh, for the emergency meeting we're having tomorrow. But that's a wonderful development. Hmm? A wonderful decision by our king. Their union will create lots of opportunity for our people. Exactly. It's a welcome development. I, I don't know why the sad face. In all this, have you considered Lotana's stand? Oh no. What kind of stand are you talking about? If I may ask. Besides, the decision was taken by his father, not by a commoner. What? Have you forgotten camps in a hurry? No. Have you forgotten all that camps did for Lutana? Have you forgotten? Have you forgotten how Lutana loves her so much? Have you all forgotten? Oh no. We are supposed to be futuristic. That is the reason we are called the elders of the land. Have you considered what we stand to benefit if Prince Lotana marries Princess Zikura? Her father is not just a king, but a high and influential senator at the federal level. The first king in the eastern part who hosted the president in his kingdom he can get the president to sign for a federal university in this our kingdom. And other things that can be beneficial to us. You are talking of Kamsi. Who is Kamsi? Just a common daughter of uh, late Okanta the Panwine Tapa. What can she benefit us? What can she offer? She already offered her all in the past. What mm -hmm. else do you want her to do mm -hmm. that she has not done? What else? The Prince Lotana that I know, who is stubborn like his father, will never leave Kamsi for any other woman, no matter what the situation. Mm -hmm. She will not agree. Have seen it? <laughs> they are after benefit and whatever, money and all the rest of them, what they can get. But they are not after the joy and peace of Prince Lotana. Without considering, what it might result or what it might lead to. Which of course we know it, that it might lead to father and son battle. Since our king, our king is eyeing the position of king of kings of this state. So I don't know. Exactly my fear. Yes, exactly my fear. Elders of Anyogugu. What do we do in this kind of situation? What do we do? <clears throat> that is a very powerful decision. Very powerful one, Father. He has no option than to abide by it. Aside being our Father, you are the King of this ancient and powerful kingdom. Your word is law. I wish your brother can just be like you. 
things would have been much better for me. You don't have to bother yourself, Father. I am enough for you. As the prince of this kingdom, Father, I will stand by you. I will support you. I will be a pillar beside you. Thank you, my son. I appreciate it. I wish Princess Zikora chose you instead of your brother. That would have gladdened my heart. Oh. <laughs> Father, you do not have a problem with that. Lotanna will marry Zikora. Because by the time I am done for strengthening that county of a girl, she will have no option than to run out of this kingdom. And when that happens, your ambition of becoming the king of kings of this state will see the limelight. Wow. <laughs> I knew you were glad in my heart. That was why I sent for you. Thank you. That's okay, Father. Uh, come to think of it, Father. You're getting older. And at your age, you're not supposed to be thinking so much. Because high blood pressure is a silent killer. But your brother will not agree to that. Honestly, I am tired and I don't know what to do. You have an option, Father. Make me the heir apparent to your throne. And I promise you, you will never regret it for the rest of your life. <laughs> you mean he bought all these things for you? Yes, Mama. He's such a nice man. I, I know I cannot see these things, but when I touch them, mm. I knew they were beautiful. <laughs> He's indeed a gentleman. I mean, which handsome and rich man will be in love with a blind girl? Except the blind girl is a millionaire, right? <laughs> Mama, I love him so much. But I am scared. What are you scared of exactly, my daughter? Mama, which parents would allow their son marry a blind girl? Huh? <clears throat> yes, Mama. Through my years of existence, I've learned to know that what will be will be. It's just a matter of time. Mama. Time seems to have eluded me in this journey. Yes. Just keep your feet straight and go in. No one knows what Chuku Okikabiyama has in store. Ma? What of if pressure overwhelms him and, and he abandons me? What will I do? My daughter. If he were to yield to pressure, he would have done that a long time ago. But peradventure he does that, God will provide your own man for you. Why all these questions? Mama, when he came here earlier, I sensed fear and pressure. Nothing happened. Mama, are you sure? Yes. Prince Lutana, fairest of them all, how have you been? I am pleased to behold your charming face again. <laughs> so tell me, how have you been? Juliet, I have been fine. <laughs> the one that has a way with words. The goddess of words. <laughs> Tell me what you want. Huh? What do I owe these fancy compliments? What's going on? The drama we always beat the tune they know best. There she goes again. Why not welcome me 
You're already welcomed, my darling. I see that drink in your hand. It speaks of the fact that you have been <laughs> welcomed to the royal home. Mm -hmm. What else do you want? Still Ricky as ever. You know, I could give you a hug. I believe that Santa would freely uh, offer hugs. Have you come here to see your godfather, the king? Lutana. Yes. Why are you behaving like a child? I've been in love with you ever since, even before I traveled for my education. Now coming back, Lutana, you not still see me? Tell me, what else do you want me to do for you to see how I feel about you? Just do nothing and stay away from me. Stop throwing yourself at me. It demeans you, it makes you little, and it's not good. Hmm? However, you are welcome to the royal home. I believe that the guards and the maidens will take care of you. Huh? And my father will be down soon. Huh? He'll come just. Not now. Not now, my not good enough for you. <clears throat> Lotta! What is going on for this guy? Like, I don't understand. Am I not good enough? Hey, Joy. Who is that beautiful lady you just served drink earlier on? You don't remember her? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I brought her your maid. Auntie Juliet, that comes to see Prince some years back. Auntie Juliet, Auntie Juliet. Which Auntie Juliet now, huh? Me. Madam, how many Auntie Juliet do you know? How many? Auntie Juliet that used to dash us money before leaving now. Hey! Auntie Juliet! Yes. The one that is in love with Empress Lotanna. But she more. See how fresh she's looking now. Oh! If I fresh, the warrior. Hey! <laughs> but I pity her. Why? <laughs> If she does not leave the prince, she will have high BP this period. Though. Why do you say so? Have you forgotten? Oh, is or it... you are just addicted? Is it because of Kamsi? You are just addicted. Have you forgotten our king wants to be the king of kings of this state? Mm -hmm. Who doesn't know that? Madam. Earlier today, I overheard the king telling Prince Lutana to consider marrying the, the senator's daughter. The famous Princess Zikora? Yes, sir. Hey, um, what did the prince say? See, Madam, I said I overheard. I was not there. And why didn't you hear it to the end? Hey, this life no balance. Room. Fight for royalty. Two classic babe and one village girl. Hey. I just hope what I'm sensing is not what is going to happen. Madam, what is that you are sensing? <laughs> <laughs> Are you shouting like a market woman? Don't you know this is the palace? Hey, call it whatever you like. That's your business. Look, I have come to warn you that you should. Will you shut that trap and come out up before Google will twist your tongue for you? Need I remind you that I've been in existence in this palace before you brought your little shameful self in? Wow. I guess you don't possess what it takes to satisfy a king. <laughs> and that's why he, he came for a more satisfying person. I wish you no know men well. Well, let me tell you. You know, when a little girl starts overlating, she thinks she has possessed all it takes to be called a woman. Retrace your step, else 
I will show you that I am the head queen in this palace. Head queen, head queen every time. Well, I have come to bond you to bring you this sharp mouth of yours. Because the next time you go to my husband and start talking about who takes over as the next king of this great kingdom, you will have me to contend with. Woman, I will allow your stupidity to slide tonight. But when next you try this, you won't be this lucky. Talk is cheap. Listen, I am always ready for my foes. I am always ready for you, no matter how strong you think you are. Stupid woman. Don't worry. Don't worry. I will tame you very soon. <laughs> ah. All right. I have had enough of this your madness in this house. What was what, 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 just so you, you cannot go out there and hustle like every other reasonable woman out there. What is wrong with you? Chita, I tried. There's no food anywhere. Me, I'm hungry myself. I've not eaten since today. That means you're looking for my trouble. You are looking for my trouble. I don't want my neighbors to hear my voice now and, and feel I don't have conscience. Oh, you know I can never do for your trouble. Oh, yeah, Shiro. Yeah. My friend, come on, come on, come on, Shiro. Oh, yeah, Shiro. Don't, 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 don't,
what do I do? What do I do? He is the father of my child, my unborn child. He is the father of my unborn child. Oh, my princess, you are welcome to our kingdom. As a matter of fact, I, my family, and the entire kingdom have been waiting for this magnificent feat of yours to grace this palace. Please, have a wonderful stay in our palace. Please, you're welcome. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. Thank you so much. My princess. Oh, my princess. In fact, rumors didn't do justice to your elegance. Your ravaging beauty is unprecedented. You're very much welcome to our palace. We cannot wait to treat you to a scrumptious meal. Thank you You're so welcome. much, my queen. Thank You're you welcome. so much. I appreciate your majesty. I can't see Lutana. Did he travel? Oh, yes. He has been preparing for this particular day. As a matter of fact, that was why he slept so late. I believe he's dressing up now. He will join us soonest at the dining. <laughs> That's so kind of him. Our uh, princess, on behalf of uh, Igwe's cabinet members, I welcome you to this great kingdom. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, my precious. How about my friend, your father, Sadat Amba? He's doing very well, Your Majesty. He sent his regards. I know. He's a good friend. You're welcome there. You're welcome. <laughs> Who is that? Who is that? It's me. Come see. Mama, welcome. Can't say, what is going on? Why are you crying? Mama, no, nothing. I, I am fine. You are not fine. You know you can tell that to a stranger, not me. So talk to me. What is it? Mama, Norma told me that the palace is welcoming. Princess Zikora in a grand style. So? She said that the elders are wearing their royal attire. <laughs> Mama, he made it something special, something symbolic. So? Mama, stop. Can't you read the writing on the wall? Remember, our king has always wanted to be the king of kings of the state. So if they are welcoming Princess Ikura and Krasta, it means that there's more to, to this than meets the eyes. Just have faith. What will be, will be. Stop crying, not a word this year. Mama, I am scared. I am, I am very scared, Mama. It's okay. It's okay. Mama, 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 if not that you gave birth to me, eh? Mama, if not that you gave birth to me, I will, I will push out of my sight. Why would you say such a nonsense thing? You have already done that. You have already pushed me out of your sight with your words. Yes. Chetachi, what has come over you? You have become a shadow of yourself because of what does not matter. Because of a matter that does not have weight. Mama, it is now obvious that this girl has succeeded in poisoning your heart against your own son. Your only son, Mama. Your only son. I cannot support evil. That you know. You got this girl pregnant. That is why she is here. If you know you cannot take care of her, then why did you have an affair with her in the first place? Why? Yes, I'm asking you why. Why? 
My son, we have always taken care of each other. Yes. This girl that I see is not a lazy girl. She could be a blessing to you. That is what I want you to realize. Don't allow me to insult you, Mama. Mama, don't make me insult you. Okay, from Kayakun now. Kayakun now. Mama, you're in a rubbish. Mama, you're in a complete rubbish. I don't know sense. Mama, how can she be a blessing to me? My life is like this. No, my life is getting worse like this by the day. How? Mama, look, if that girl knows what is good for her, Mama, she better pack her things and get out of this house. Get out of this house before I, before I, before I do something. Only Nachomo. Only Hi. Is that why you are treating her so badly? Is that why you are treating her like that? Do you realize that that girl almost died last night? You left her all alone in the cold to die. Chetachi. Ah. Chetachi, I want you to know something. Whatever that goes around comes around. Nature is watching us. Yes. Hi, karma is real. It is real. If not for Ikena, if not for Ikena that bought her medicine this morning, who knows what would be her fate? Who knows what would have been her fate? Mama, how is, how, how, I mean, how, how is this all this, all this nonsense you're saying now? How is it my concern, Mama? How is it my concern? Mama, that's the nature should have told you that I don't want her. I don't, is it difficult for you to understand? Then what, I told about, you? Me? Then what about me? What about your mother? What happened? Why do you no longer take care of me? Why do you no longer buy my drugs? It's the same thing, Mama. It's the same thing. A child that says that the mother will not sleep, will you call it not sleep? Oh. Since you have decided to take sides with her, no problem. Mama, there is no problem. You will suffer the same way with her. It's as simple as that. Ah. Uh -uh. Chetachi. Chetachi. Ah. Ay.